These are the top five things that I love most about my E86 since buying her 16 years ago. Number five, the smell of the interior. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing that I love about it, but I, I can't explain why I love it so much. It just, it's got an unusual smell to it. it, and, it and I can't properly describe it either. I just call it the 80s smell. So I put forth a question, a weird question for the floor. Your favorite car that you own for many years. What does the interior smell like? Can you describe it? Can you put your finger on it? Because I can't. I just call it the 80s. Number four. This manual transmission, especially after I put the uh, short shift kit in it, because it is just so much fun to drive. And I love the clutch. It's so forgiving. It's so much fun to drive. I just really enjoy doing that, especially with when you heel toe and you do it without thinking. You ever have you ever done that where you catch yourself um, doing the heel toe? You look down and at the right possible second. I've managed to catch myself once and I was in awe just knowing that I've successfully trained my feet to do that. Number three, basically the ease to repair this car. Um, everything's there. Unlike today's cars where they could, designers are just sticking everything they possibly can into an engine bay or put as much stuff as possible into the dash to make it practically impossible to to do. Um, I've taken my car apart many times, and every single time you, I do it, it it's, it's fun and a headache. But, geez, working on all cars are a headache. What are you kidding? Number two, the sound of my ITBs and my HKS high-power exhaust. I'm like, I'll put a uh, link in the description for all, all the drives, interior, exterior, and whatnot. I just love that sound. It's so addicting. But to be honest, I love the sound of my modded IS on carb. I look, the sound of the Weber was okay, but nothing will ever top the sound of those side draft carburetors. Nah. And number one, my favorite thing, Well, I love my green LEDs, but the biggest one, of course, is those flip-up headlights. And of course, the yellow fogs. I just love the overall design of the car. Can't really call it timeless because it is a wedge in the 80s. Every single car had a wedge design. But this little car always yanks at my heartstrings. I just love the way it looks. There you have it. My top five loves of this car, of my E86. Um, what are your top favorite loves of your cars? Especially, I'm curious to know. What does your interior smell like? Yeah, that's a really odd question, ain't it? So please like, subscribe, and comment. Especially subscribe, because coming up will be... Uh, the top five things that I hate about this car. This is A for Hachi signing off.